How's it going guys? My name is Graham and welcome to Budden Pals. I'm trying to think of how you would say it because it's clearly like bud but kind of like puddin. Budden? Budden? It's something like that. This is my little Budden Pal right here. Little furry, furry one at that. I guess she's just, she's having to walk in as I was firing up the game so I guess she'll just hang out for a little bit. Thank you Dungeon Nation for sending me a key. I'm pretty interested in trying this one out because it seems like a little bit of like a, a take on like a Tamagotchi kind of idea. You're looking after your little furry friend. Hi there! We hope you have as much fun taking care of your button pal as you can. However, aside from a general sound and faint of heart warning, there's something you should know. While playing button pals, you may enjoy yourself most of the time, but more often than not, there are people who have moments of reluctance to view things. The proper thing to do here is to close your eyes, or preferably, hide behind the nearest corner of the wall possible until it's over. Simple. Hope you didn't say too much boring st hope we didn't say too much boring stuff. Me too, I hope I, I similarly didn't bore everyone. Now it's time for you to embark on your journey among the button pals. Good luck! So it is like a silly, cartoony, come Tamagotchi-ish adventure. But I think the game has weird undertones, and I it's very much excluded from like the Steam uh, screenshots, previews, everything like that. So I have no idea to what extent if it's subtle, it's if it's overt, if it's continuous, if it's rare. That's the thing I'm most excited about because I, I I think this game is going to be very different from what it originally appears. It's a mellow afternoon in my college dorm room. I've got a few more months left until I graduate. Pretty exciting. Family's proud, so that's good. But aside from that, all that future taking off stuff, today's kind of exciting in and, of, in and of itself. I'm getting a pet. The campus allows them and I've always loved animals ever since I was little. Ding dong. Oh, that's him. My buddy dropped him off for me. Let's go meet our new companion. Oh, it's fragile. <laughs> oh. Uh, it's just a box. Strange that you wouldn't assume that there's not something within the box. It also appears that it's taped up somewhere where there's no split in the box. Unless my friend got him here in a box with no holes. I was just about to say, it appears to be not breathable. That's a bit off-putting. Ah, well, let's open it up anyhow. Whatever this monster is inside doesn't need to breathe. Also, keep hitting the box to open it. I would rather like cut it open or tear into it more carefully. I don't want to just like start punching the hell out of this thing that I think might have a struggling to breathe animal inside. Phew, who was the wise guy who forgot to poke holes in this thing? What? What is that? This weird broccoli headed cat that can talk. Your lucky cardboard boxes aren't air sealed. You'd have adopted a corpse otherwise. And that's no fun for either of us. What is this and why does it talk? Wow, nice place you have here. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say this will be an easy transition to a new home. Nice to meet you, sir. I could have sworn I only took a tiny sip at Norm's party. <laughs> tiny sip of alcohol or maybe a little bit, something a little bit funnier perhaps. So, uh, did you come up with a name for me yet? A name? Uh, oh. Oh, I can't make him twinkle dink. <laughs> Now I say it out loud, I probably shouldn't call him Twinkle Dink. I'll call him Dwinkle and we'll all secretly know what that means. I'm gonna go with Dwinkle. Dwinkle, huh? I like it. Dwinkle Dwinkle. You've gifted me such a perfect name. <laughs> Just picturing Twinkle Dink, Twinkle Dink. Meh. <laughs> well, Mr. Uh, what's your name anyhow? <laughs> Brian? Brian, our friendship is just beginning. Enough chatter. Let's get things started. S started? Usually when you bring like a cat home, it has is fully on. It's, you know, there's nowhere to go. You just now live with the pet. You can look after it however you want, but it's it's already happened. You don't really initiate ownership. Not the way this guy seems to be indicating. Day one. Oh god. The we just count down the days of the rest of our horrible life with this annoying little twinkle dink running around? Yeah, started! What did you think was gonna happen? We've got plenty of fun things we can do before our first day together is done. We can do anything. Two items will end each day though, I believe, so keep that in mind. 
So I think you can figure out from there. Let's do something. That's his like overall how happy he is. I have 2,000 Dwinkle dollars. <laughs> For whatever reason they have his face straight on them. That's a weird... Is that his arm sticking out of his head? It looks weird. I guess I have to go buy things first. I could get him a cool shirt. It's got like a bat on it or something. It looks pretty cool in my opinion. A top hat. Dapper top hat with a streak of darker gray across it. Bubble blower. The good old bubble solution and wand. Tons of fun despite bubbles not even weighing a gram. The tons of fun. Let alone a ton. Oh, it, it kind of beat it over the head there by explaining it at the end. <laughs> a revolving hurdle in the form of a semi-thick rope with handles on each end. Hop, hop, hop. I like the idea of considering it a revolving hurdle. Um, there's nothing on the second page though, right? Yeah, that's it for now. Well, I will get the jump rope and the cool bat hat. The shirt. Whatever. I might as well... Should I buy everything? Nah, I won't just yet. I'm only allowed to use two things per day, so I'll... I'll use those two for now and, I don't know, invest the rest. I'm quite excited by all this. You seem like a really nice guy, too. Your place is so pretty. Just everything. All this is so great. A new life as Dwinkle is sounding really quite appealing. Well, thank you again for adopting me. I really appreciate it. You're so welcome. Oh, did that count as one item for the day? Well, the other one is you can have this cool shirt, I guess. How do you feel about that? It just, you click on him, he just looks so proud. I'm gonna give him like a nice little pet or something. Hey, he seems to really enjoy that. Car keys, I can't even like move around my apartment. He's, he's just still super excited. He seems stoked about everything. Thanks for adopting me. Was that the end of the day? <laughs> the day? <laughs> wow, time sure flies when you're having fun. It's getting dark already. How'd it get dark so fast? What is going on here? Is this animal, like, consuming my life? I'm not gonna take care of myself. I'm gonna forget to, like, eat and drink and hygiene and everything like that, and my life will just crumble apart. I'm waiting for things to take a weird turn. Well, thanks for such a warm welcome. I think I'm gonna take it easy for the night. Catch you later. Where are you going? What is... What are your nightly activities, like... was starting to turn into a picture of like a real home for a second rather than this cartoon. Wooden words of wisdom. Four, six cups of water or something. Whatever it was, it's a bit silly. Just drink when you're thirsty. Thanks for that. There's the cool shirt I left him. Is he escaping? He left his shirt behind and, and left overnight? What the hell? God, my head hurts. What happened? Did I pass out? I don't feel good at all. What time is it? Almost 7 a.m.? Nothing like that has ever happened to me. Wait, is this the real world? What the shit was that? <laughs> Brian, are you okay? I think so. Day two. Nah, we'll, we'll put that in the past. We'll have a nice, lovely day together. You look like you saw a ghost. Anyhow, let's tackle this day head on, Brian, and make it a good one. Okay, I still have the items from before. I'm back up to 2,000. I guess I'll buy up, like, everything else? I don't think there's any point buying a second shirt. Let's... You can have the hat? I use the hat with you, and then let's use the let's use the jump rope. Hop around. Uh, whenever I'm ready. Well, that was pretty easy. <laughs> well, this is kind of ridiculous. I'm gonna ace this. No problem. Looking at a high score. I I haven't played years of hot hot jump rope or whatever it's called in Mario Party Two. I I, I didn't master that game to throw it all away now. The way the shirt kind of lags behind as you're jumping is goofy. Oh, the speed is reaching a point that, like, I, I don't really... I just essentially have to click the second I touch the ground. Oh, I, I accidentally started it again. Well, whatever. It seems like I was just kind of competing with myself. Bubble blower. Bubbles. Do you like bubbles, little twinkle nuts? Whatever your name was. That's a, those are fun, right? You like that? 
I think I used them all up. I think that was the maximum allowable amount of bubbles. No, that's... I hit whatever the max was. Now I can start playing around with it again. Oh, I want to hit that max size. There we go. Without having it pop, because it can go too big and pop. Oh, that one was even better. Congratulate me on my awesomeness. Oh, nice. His happiness is, like, all the way to the top now. He's so stoked. We're such good pals. Ah, oh, it's another day wrapped up. Take it easy, friend. Where do you go? What do you do when we, like, call it a day? Button words of button? Button? I still haven't figured that out. My feet smell funny, I guess. Hey, my wisdom can always be a winner. The, uh... Picture, what the hell? I don't know, it, it's just a common cool picture as is, but it makes me think of that Pink Floyd album, too. Nothing as weird happened that night. Hey, so you probably have college classes today, don't you? Being Monday and all. I won't keep you from that, so let's have some fun first. I won't keep you from that, but let's immediately keep you from that. The spaceship nightlight flashes a soothing light onto the ceiling and will display stars whizzing past the spaceship in shadows. So you, you can just go ahead and play with this yourself? Oh, crap. Uh, I, I couldn't really... Well, I don't really want to do it a second time, but I wasn't prepared for the minigame to involve anything other than the mouse. Well, let's just talk. What do you got going on, man? Your college campus is really well kept. You're quite lucky to attend here. Life starts here and all. <laughs> Every night he's like, oh, oh shucks. So, so disappointing that we can't spend more time together. Take it easy, Brian. Did I ever go to classes? Hard to know. Maybe that's where I'm headed now. Maybe he's not actually saying goodnight. He's just like, hey, have fun at campus. Where are you, you creep? He's like crawling around in my room, isn't he? Huh. Nothing sketchy there. Up and at him. More shop stuff. Ooh, I heart button pals shirt. Ah, uh, do you now? Officially licensed. I should buy myself one and we can match. Do you feel good about this shirt? Is this shirt what you wanted? Uh, there's nothing else we can really play around with. I I do kind of want to try this again. Do I have to repurchase it? You do have to repurchase it. Ah, that explains a few things. Well, yeah, I want to try and like do actual something, anything. Well, spacebar isn't how you shoot, so I have no idea. What the fuck? I feel like it was switching between mouse controls and keyboard controls. I have no idea what's going on there. Well, night night again. Sorry I wasted the entire day being god awful at that game. Didn't get a whole lot out of that, did we? There must be something I have to do to like advance that scene maybe? Because it just seems like normal nights so far. Oh, he brought me a piece of poo! Thank you! Thanks for bringing a piece of shit. Oh! Well, I'm sorry I broke that. I hope you didn't care about it at all. Rad looking vest. Oh, radical dude. Very shiny and smooth with a white thin undershirt. <laughs> yeah, I think that'll look extra cool. There, yeah, you pumped about that? That's a pretty good, pretty good hookup, wouldn't you say? Not fitting on the button there is kind of funny. Well... Let's see, we just chat. Oh, I took some pictures outside the other day. Would you like to see one? Oh, I meant to say yes. I'm sorry, dude. I didn't mean to crap on your hobby. You okay? I hope you haven't been stressed out lately. Lately, Remember to take frequent breaks. Damn, I really wanted to see his pictures. They're probably going to be messed up. Don't let the bed bugs bite. I believe you would be responsible for it if they did. Anime wig, a giant sword not included. It also doesn't seem to fit your head fully, it just kind of rests on top of your head. If it's your thing, though, I guess you'll just make do with what's available to you. There you go, man. We got a real solid look going for you this time now. Can I do anything to, like, lower his health? Can I just, like, ignore him completely? Utilize no items? I took some pictures. Yeah, I, I do want to see them this time. I don't want to accidentally click on the wrong side. Here it is. Grass. That was it? It was just the one and only picture? I'm glad showing you that picture of grass made you happy, dude. I, I truly, truly am. Oh, you do control it with the mouse. I just, it's just 
very precise, apparently. Until tomorrow. Well, next time I know better now, and I'll try and not screw it up so royally. You. You, you in all your glory. What the Why do you have to say to me? It's a blessing spending the night with you. You didn't sleep well last night. That appeared so suddenly. I... Like, usually when that happens in a game, it, like, twitches around on the screen and plays a hyper-loud noise. That was a very sudden appearance and, like, very quiet audio. Morning. Uh, uh, my friend Bip there is taking a nap. Just don't bother him, okay? Yeah, I didn't get much sleep this morning. Forgive me. Should I... I'm gonna try to not blow up the poop, maybe? Blue vest. I've got a high-pitched, raspy voice aura about it. Does it mean anything? Probably not. That that must be a, a reference to something in particular. I saw it and immediately thought of like Aladdin. I'm not sure what its deal is. Oh, I did that. Just scrolling over him irritated him. He looks like a weird Pikachu. I'm sorry I bummed you out. What does breaking your poop apart do? That didn't bum him out. He was fine with that. Can I cheer you up just with a little like chin scratch or whatever? Well, I'm sorry. I'm sorry to kind of ruin things there. I'll try to remember to leave your buddy alone next time. Now let's try and finally not suck at this. It doesn't... I guess it's all about dodging. I was trying to shoot. I was trying to shoot the things. It's just don't get hit, I guess. It will we'll finally... There, an all-time high score. Never done so well in this minigame before, ever. The 14. That's enough for me. I'll never try again. Take it easy, Brian. I still managed to cheer him up a, a wee little bit. Ooh, he hasn't given me a words of wisdom in a while. There seem to be certain outside influences that upset Budden Pal. If you see suspicious things, act on them. I'd rather choose to ignore them. You win all your glory. Why do you have to be so perfect? It's a blessing spending the night with you. You win all your what? Why do I do something or other? It feels accusatory. In, like, the edited version of this, I'm gonna turn it up so hopefully you guys can hear it a bit better, but it's, like, quiet enough that I, like, cannot hear what that thing is saying to me. I have no idea what's going on. Good morning! New item. The Colorful Beanie. A couple muted colors is colorful enough to bear the title of Colorful Beanie. <laughs> Yeah, I think it's time to change up the look. Wow, that's, that does not fit properly at all. Oh, I took some pictures outside. I, there, it's just a picture of this guy. If I keep talking to him about that, I bet sooner or later he's going to show me something messed up. Like, a weird blurry photo again. <laughs> Goodness, college classes were rough today. I sat on my butt all day writing down notes and doing work. I think I put on a few pounds, too. Huh. No comment. <laughs> By saying nothing, he did effectively just call me fat. I swear, Dwinkle. Put me down like that again and you're out on your ass. Never apologize for having fun and enjoying things in life. Of course, he doesn't show up that night try to pay such close attention to what he might be saying because I never expected him to show up twice in one time. There's like a weird gray cat playing a Game Boy or on its phone or something. Hey! We gonna talk about this? We just gonna ignore that that creature is there? There's no new shop item this time, is there? No. Oh, I took some pictures. Yeah, show me the pictures, but then let's talk about... Now, now you're wandering around at night, but let's talk about your friend. Bubbles, you can enter and float around. Why are we not funding this? <laughs> I'm weird like that. I thought he was going to tell me that, like, the bubble blowing thing that we can buy in the store, we can float around in them. But now he's just, I guess he's taking that concept and, and coming up with bigger and brighter things. Night, night. I'll see you tomorrow, dude. I'm going to be listening carefully. Another, another quiet night. Oh, he looks depressed. Morning. Oh, uh, my friend Bip there is taking a nap, so don't bother him, okay? Didn't get much sleep, forgive me. He seems okay now. There's nothing new for me to invest in. This world's a piece of hot garbage, you know that? If only the other, more well-put universes could hear my cries and come upstage you all out of your misery. This guy's twinkles from another universe? 
and he hates this one, apparently. He's already in a low state, so if I disturb his buddy, it didn't, it didn't put it lower. I want to be human. It's so weird. Sometimes I really do, and other times it's a mere afterthought. He's going to try and steal our body. Oh, he's going to bed so depressed. I bummed him out too much. I didn't mean to be such a jerk, but I kind of did mean it. Another quiet night. Morning to you too. Ah, a new shop item finally. Flashlight. Looks like the intention was for you to play hide and seek with it outside at night. I'm down for that. Let's give it a try. Ah, oh, yeah, we can play tonight. Mm, so do I just have to wait for night time to come then? Would I have to, had to have used that second or anything? The world's a piece of hot garbage. Man, he's just an angry kitty creature, whatever he is. Are we actually going to play with the flashlight or are you just you ditching? You flaking on that plan. Okay. <laughs> Okay, everyone's gone and hid somewhere in the park. You have to go and find all three of them and then report back to me and you win. Just use the, the keys to walk around and search for everyone. I'll be here. Good luck. I, I found you. What the hell weird 3D-ness is this? Okay, well, it looked all fully fenced off on that side, so I guess, uh, I guess we're carrying on out here. This is kind of peculiar. I don't really know what the friends I'm looking for look like. Is this a gravestone or like a trash can? Nothing, nothing here. It is a park, so it's probably a trash can. <laughs> park closed after dark, so we shouldn't be out here? I'd say I, I get that. I f personally feel like maybe I shouldn't be out here. There's my can again, my reference point. I, I believe I've gone in a loop and found no one. This is a lot of walking around to find literally no creatures of any kind. I, uh, I'm getting wigged out by that. Now I'm getting mildly lost. I have a vague concept. Yo, it's me, Rosemary. You want a hint? I can give you a hint for 1,000 bunning coins. I mean, are you a hint? Is it a hint or... Like, you're not one of the friends I'm trying to find? Gave me a little bit of a okay. start. Okay, listen well. Your hint is... Behind three patches of weeds lie one of your friends. Well, I didn't really want the hint, but I kind of felt like I had to take it, because that was the only way I was going to proceed, right? That was some garbage. I got hosed. Here, this one seems a little more straightforward. The nappy creature, the one that's always sleeping. Oh, but now I've reached an actual dead end, so now I have to kind of vaguely remember where I have and haven't been, which is... might take a bit. Oh, there it is. It was just weird seeing it at a side angle like that. Sweet! Oh, crap, do I have to make it all the way back to Dwinkle? Oh, what the shit? It's like a grave robber or something. Uh. Okay, well, I'm gonna try and zip past him. Nope, that doesn't quite work. Brian, it was only the park landscaper. Yeah, okay, why did he assault me? Everything's gonna be fine. Let's head back. Don't look so pleased. Are we gonna talk about this? Morning. It seems like we're not gonna talk about it. I kind of want to know what just happened. Always something vaguely insightful or predictive in these. Tasty, too. Well, I don't want to do that again. I don't want to go back out there again. Let's just read our fortune cookie and enjoy the note. Congestion clears and minds free themselves today. Six happiness points. For me or for... Dwinkle or how does that pan out? I just wish I could wake up one night to some kind of deity who would take me away. Take me away on the moonlit sorry night and make me something I couldn't fathom in my imperfect form now. <laughs> Frieza! <laughs> my final form! That's all, I, I, that's all I can think of is that this guy's like gonna level himself up like a Pokemon. Somewhere between a Pokemon and a Frieza. <laughs> See you in the morning. Am I slowly making this pet depressed? Am I not giving it enough attention? Maybe, maybe you are supposed to start 
care of a pet and then live it. Live it each and every day to the best of your ability. Did you ever hope you'd have an amazing dream one night? Those simple times are the greatest. I have had that feeling before. Just hoping that your dream doesn't suck. I feel like I've also hoped for a good dream, but like mostly I'm just like, oh, I hope I don't have a nightmare. Watch too many scary movies lately or something. Uh oh, my friend Bip is taking a nap. Oh, I guess, okay. Okay, I won't bother him this time since I've bothered him every other time it's come up. Parrot shades. Cool people don't need passerbys being able to see their eyeballs, what they're looking at and all. That's true. Hide your eyes. It's for your own good. Plus, you look cool as hell. Let's let's play with Bubbles, I guess. You were all excited about Bubbles the other day. Whoops, I meant to use the Bubbles. That's fine. Let's blow you a couple quick Bubbles here. There. Oh, I didn't mean to blow up the poop with that. Are you happy? Was that a fun activity for the day? Night. Now it's very hard to tell how depressed you are, actually. <laughs> that would be a good argument for not giving him the sunglasses. Words of wisdom. More about smelly feet. Brought that one up again. You seem upset, little buddy. Let's, like, play games and stuff today, I guess? Doesn't really appear to keep track of a high score or anything. No, oh, I think I had 30. That seems like a new record for me, personally. The 14 I had here shouldn't be hard to beat. 30! <laughs> got 30 in both games. See you in the morning. Why are you not all cheered up, dude? I did great today. I was the world's most attentive owner. If that's not going to cheer you up, nothing will. Uneventful. I can't figure out if, like, the combination of items and, and talking and stuff is what's progressing things is what is making weird specific oddities appear. Bip is, is staying over. I'll leave him be. I won't bother him. Want to be human? Are patience and desire really the answer? <sighs> Seems like the more I mature with my ideas, the less likely they seem. Okay. I am taking a turn for the worse with my mood. <sighs> so upset with myself. I managed to get myself fuming. Why? Why am I so dissatisfi dissatisfied with myself? I hate it. I have to do something about this. I need to. But what? I gotta get out of here. So long? Is this you drawing a picture of yourself? Your wooden pal ran out the front door and wandered to campus roads never to be seen for weeks. Eventually he returns as if nothing happened. But that's another story. So I just let him get so miserable that he bailed? Achievement unlocked. Wow, I'm important. You've played for a while. <laughs> I'm gonna try and, like, kind of rush through things and, and see how to maybe achieve a different ending. Oh, this time you get the weird yellow elephant thing. Oh, hi, I'm Moppy. One of, well, the green guy's friends? I'm here in place for him because I've been so enamored by your life. Huge fan. Wait, so I just suddenly... Uh, this is the same... I'm I'm still Brian and I'm, I'm getting a new pet now that he peaced out. So I, I guess we get started then with a, a nickname, right? Well, he started out as Moppy. So now he can be Floppy. Floppy W. It's short for Floppy Wiener. Floppy W, that's you. Oh, that works. From here on out, I'm Floppy W. <laughs> now, let's get what I'm honored to be a part of started. Honored to be a part of. Just my own pet ownership? Is that not what you're a part of? Hey. What's up, buddy? I, I can more or less just buy you the exact exact same stuff. Let's just chat? <laughs> this guy doesn't like talking, does he? Good night. That's the only word he said to me all day. Presuming that our first day started after that initial initial introduction there. Remember to keep yourself well groomed. Hmm. You start earning things in a different order though. Maybe that's kind of randomized. You can have the hat. I don't know if I'm going to give you a bat shirt. We're going to jump rope twice. How about that? But I don't really care what the score is. Two rounds of rope? Is that enough to make you happy? He's like, he's still middle. Don't, I never really learned how to raise or lower it. 
If anyone around you ever hates ice cream, they have no soul. Or they're allergic to dairy. <laughs> I'm gonna totally skip over nights where nothing happens. Ooh, a bandana. Or a scarf. Either way, it's really pretty. And it's new, so... Don't mind if I do. Aw, oh, that looks stylish as hell. We have need a shirt. That looks great. This guy doesn't talk. So I, I guess we just like play around. Yeah, he won't talk to me. So I guess we just play with things all day. He's like maximum happy. I guess he liked the bandana. Maybe changing clothes is, plays a big part in keeping them happy. You possess more power than you think. May not seem to show, but it comes out eventually. I'm going to leave the pile of poop in the corner. I don't think I'm gonna bother. Oh, I clicked it on accident through the shop. Okay, that's fine then, I guess. I'm gonna make you some bubbles, and then I'm gonna bubble you up a second time. Look at that. You happy with this amount of bubbles? Is that good? Is that good for you? Better than talking? Oh, the game taught color with the officially licensed Budden Pals Adventures video game in it from way back when. Well, I would like to take a couple stabs at this, because presumably the first attempt's not going to go great. Okay! I thought we were actually going to play it. I don't think we'll have time for that. Why not? Squeeze it in. I told you to. Really? That didn't even count as, like, spending a, a, a time or anything? Well, since you never talked to me, at the very least we could read a fortune cookie and just see what that has to say. Sometimes things don't work out. This is one of those times got one happiness point. I don't know if happiness really played a role previously. We got like six that one time and my guy still left me forever because he was depressed. Remember to slow down and take stuff in sometimes. Like your food. Chew slower. Oh, is this because I did the game taught? Yeah, so I'm like not allowed to do it twice or whatever. So that was all just... Oh, well, those are spikes. So by, by gearing it up once, I, I ensured that we would... Uh, play it afterwards, so you're not allowed to select it two times. Ah. So you can't give yourself double opportunity to try. Oh man, does it reset completely when you screw up like that? That's very unforgiving. It is playing like the like the most semi-Mario song I've ever heard. It shared like a couple of notes briefly. What is this? That's the world's crappiest Goomba. Jeez, I don't know how much longer this is. Uh, yeah, perfect. Nice! Level clear! Oh, just the level? Is that not the entire thing? I feel like I won. I feel like I won that game. Maybe if I say to play it again, then we'll, like, try to progress to the next level? Shay hey there, Bip is sleeping back there. You shouldn't disturb him. I hope I'm no trouble. I just need to rest my eyes for a few dreams, then I'll be good. I'll leave you to it then, man. I don't need to be a bother. I would like to buy another game tot, though, and, like, if we play it again, I want to see if we advance to a different level. Hmm, yeah, still doesn't want to talk. Good night. I didn't dis I didn't disturb Bip, so you're welcome for that. Level 2! Okay, I can continue to try and progress through this. It's very much the, like, second world or level of Mario. Uh, I hope there's four, and like the fourth one is, is like the castle equivalent. I don't really know what to do here. Oh, I didn't realize there was pla platforms. Crap. Oh, nice. This is, this is much easier to deal with. <laughs> Having the platform come to you there. Oh, there we go. I've been struggling with that repeatedly. I lost like all of my lives in that one spot. No, that was probably right at the end. Crap. The amount of time I'm committing to playing this little platformer within this game seems excessive. Crap. Ugh. Well, I don't know if it will start me over from level one if I try again, so I don't know if it's worth it. We got a new item anyways. The Giga Gulp Soda may cause severe bloating. Maybe we have two then. How severe could it possibly be? Oh, gross. <laughs> Oh, it's like, that replaces his scarf. I just made him chunky. Well, I'm gonna make him fat and then send him off to bed. See what he thinks of that. He doesn't even seem to care. Seems happy as uh, as can be. I don't know why sometimes ah. you don't I had a get 
Can I sleep with you? The words of wisdom. Didn't sleep well. Is that... That is this guy. That is my pet. It is Floppy visiting me at night when that happens. Not feeling too good this morning. Yesterday burned me out with college stuff. I think I'm gonna have to take a break from this stuff today, buddy. Tomorrow, I promise. Okay. Well, we're just skipping straight past. Huh. We recovered from that very quickly. Green under and over shirt. A shirt and button up, both green, not too shabby. Let's replace that dumpy, flabby body you got going on with this stylish jacket. The universe has comforted you on the sidelines once again. Five happiness points. Well, can we just keep opening fortune cookies until we're maximum happy? I did the game Todd again to see what level it puts me on. Hi. Hi. I had a nightmare. Can I sleep with you? He said hi very audibly and then mumbled something, I think, about a nightmare? I couldn't hear or tell what was going on. Oh, I do get to keep attempting the same level, but the first pal only lasted for so long, right? And so I guess in that sense, I have a limited number of attempts at this. You can hear also how like subtly Mario-ified this music is. Well, that sucked. This is the part that's gonna ruin me. Jump maximum? Yeah, maximum jump. Now I'm just gonna hang out here for a second and see if there's like a platform coming for me. It seems like kind of like it's pointing down. Oh no! Come on! I didn't think I actually had to go down, but I was. I don't know, it didn't. There wasn't a, a platform in view or anything. Ugh. Oh, there we go. Maximum edge! Whew. Okay, buddy. Button, we could do it. Oh, thank goodness. Ah, I hope there isn't too many more levels of that, but I guess I have to try it again now tomorrow night. This is really dropping, but he still he still looks happy. I'm not seeing it on his face yet. Level three. There's probably oh maybe this is gonna be the last one then. <laughs> awesome. Is that- that's- I guess that's probably one of the pals, but it kind of also looks a little bit like a, a pony, you know? Ah, crap. It appears the difficulty of this one will be notably higher than the last ones have been. That flickering fire's hilarious. The hitboxes kind of suck. Oh god, I'm getting chased. Oh, no! I trapped myself in a, a crappy situation there. Can't jump over it. Ah, whatever, that was going terribly. Head in clouds, life gets clouded. Two happiness points. I have no concept of what makes that thing visit me or the computer to turn on or how to advance. How to advance any of these little, like, secret happenings. So I guess I'm just gonna keep playing Budden Pal's Adventures. Budden? Budden? It seems like I've committed to Budden more recently. Oh, I finally made it past that goofy section. There was some annoying little bits of hyper-precision that were needed that were making it very impossible. I don't like my odds here. Oh, crap. Oh, God, there's so many of them. What the hell? <laughs> I should have just committed harder. A blender. In just three minutes flat, your pet can whip you up a delicious, nutritious three-minute smoothie. He's gonna make me one? I don't have to make him one? Sold. Smoothie me. I can make a three minute smoothie. I can make one. Yes, it's true. I can make a three minute smoothie. Yes, I can. And so can you. I can make a three minute smoothie. I can make one. Yes, it's true. I can make a three minute smoothie. Yes, I did I agree can, to this, so didn't I? I I'm make pretty one. sure this yes, loop is only about I nine seconds long. If I can make one too, then why am I making you do it? I feel like I could do it in less time, maybe. I might as well have taken this responsibility on for myself. Just a couple more loops of this, it should be done. I can finally enjoy this smoothie. It better have the works in it, man. I want bananas, strawberries, blueberries. Throw some spinach in there for a little bit of health. I don't know, throw some nuts in there for a nice thickness and deliciousness. Thank you. Give it, give it. 
How yummy. I hope I got to drink it and he didn't just use it himself. God damn. I'm never doing that again. <laughs> the craftiest kid has carried cardboard at one time. I guess you could make a lot of things out of cardboard. I don't even know what I hit that time. That sucks. I don't know. I don't fucking know if I attempt that further. A safari hat. Ready for any adventure. And you know what? You can be fat again, too, while I'm at it. I'm loading you up with just these, these great, great goodies there. How do you feel about that? Want to talk about it? Probably not. I think 14 days is how long I was playing when Twinkle left. Food t-shirt. A light brown shirt with a donut in the middle to proclaim your love of food for everyone around. Uh, there you go. That will also hide your fat belly while simultaneously procla proclaiming your love of overindulging. It balances out perfectly. Your perfection and maturity are prominent today. Six happiness points. I don't know why I keep pulling up- oh, I forgot to use the game tot. Well, whatever. I was gonna say, I don't know why I keep attempting it anyways. It's driving me crazy. Bip is sleeping, you shouldn't disturb him. I'm immediately disturbing him. Screw him. I have no idea what's been going on. <laughs> you ain't tired- you aren't tired of these things already? Why would you be tired of a fez? Fezes are always fun. I say we commit hard. The end? What? I guess it's always roughly the same amount of time, but I didn't even get like an end scrolling thing being like, I'm sorry I'm too depressed, I'm, I'm leaving. I don't really know what happened. The weirdness part was very cool and introduced very immediately, and then it like disappeared. And I like couldn't get it to come up often enough, or I couldn't figure out how to explore it properly. And so I never felt like I was really advancing that side of things. And that was the side of it that I was much more curious about, that I wanted to wanted to explore further, you know? The mini games or whatever were like, I don't know, distractions, but kind of janky and hard to play, so my interest in that was quite low. Huh. I wonder what I was missing, what I could have manipulated, what I could have done differently to try and, like, push towards making things weirder? I don't know. I don't know if I... what to make of that. One quickly, quick thing before I wrap it up. I want to see what would be in the box. It's back to being the green guy again. So, I don't even know. See, and it's not like... so it's not like a continuation or anything, because now... Uh, it's playing out the same way, so obviously you could manipulate it and try and steer it in a different direction and stuff, but like, uh, it's not like this is our third pet and second green guy, so I, I don't know. I don't know. If anyone has more experience with this game themselves, it's, it's only like a couple dollars on Steam if you want to mess around with it, because like, there's a bunch of achievements and stuff you can get for clearly discovering secrets and things in this game, and I cannot seem to dig deep enough. Thank you guys so much for watching. If anyone has ideas, I, I really genuinely do want to hear them. I'll see you again soon.